goodness. So it's been raining pretty much. Um, it started around two and then it got heavier like around five. So I'm just taking a peek. Oh my God, did y'all see that smoke? <sighs> it's cold, it's cold and I'm out here with no shoes on. Um, I just wanted to take a peek before it gets really bad, you know, because we're up here prepping for this Texas weather, but I'm definitely a Louisiana girl. Shrimp are the very last thing to go in. Where I'm from, we put eggs in our, in our gumbo. I mean, we eat it with a side of potato salad. Ooh, it's so foggy. Let's see if I can even show y'all. So, all smoked meat, right? Sausage, chicken, crabs. Of course, my shrimp going last. I got some smoked turkey next in. My eggs can go in. And that's what I'm doing. I'm actually sitting down editing um, a video for y'all. I'm so late with, I be trying to get these up by two, but they never act right. So right now, what I'm doing is getting ready to create a thumbnail. So I'm about to eat mine. My chicken so tender just fell off the bone. It's four something in the morning. My dog's always waking me up. Yeah, snow. This is August's first snow, and it's still raining and coming down. Yeah, you went. Okay, Nicole. Come on, Augie. August. Jesus, this dog. Come on, Augie. Stop eating the snow. Come on. Come on. Come on, baby. <laughs> you don't understand. Good job. Good boy, Augie. Come on, Harp, because you didn't see where Harp went. Oh, no, let's go. <laughs> oh, look, he slid. <laughs> Tell you gotta do a whole snowball. Is it even necessary? <laughs> Don't throw no damn snow in my house. It's the fact that it's still raining. It's still raining though. Yeah, a winter, a winter snow mix. So it is snowing here. We're in a winter storm. It is very beautiful out there. Luckily, we have not lost any power. We haven't lost anything. We still have running water. We still have everything. So I'm really happy about that. I'm going to go have lunch with uh, Courtney and then I'm going to go to the grocery store and go home. I had to call and tell her like what happened. Like, I know like this is probably like, probably like Renee. It's not a big deal. But, like, no, it is a big deal. It's always a big deal. It's always fun. I don't know what's going on, but we got to quit letting August ass outside because he just this this is like do y'all not see him running through the yard? Harper is trying to micromanage and bring him in. Come on, Augie, you sliding this shit. Come on. Come in the house. Come on. No, come on, come on, baby. Yay! That's not gonna work though. Not around that bench. Thursday, February 3rd. Um, I have definitely been vlogging. I've definitely been uploading for you guys. So it was like a few things I kind of wanted to come on and talk about. First, I wanted to do like some celeb topics, but I don't know, even though I've had some for the past, like this Wednesday and last Wednesday, I definitely had topics that I wanted to talk about. I just literally did not sit down in front of the camera and film. I even started to do a live yesterday. That didn't work out. I was gonna come in here today and film it, but the blinds open in my room, so that's why y'all see me in my bedroom, because I kind of had this set up, set up in here, because I was gonna film so y'all could see the snow behind me, and I was gonna wear the hat that I had on today. Um, However, that didn't work out either. That, but I had a question because currently I'm dating, right? I have been married prior, um, before, and I'm divorced. Just wanted to ask the question. Do y'all usually take yourself out for Valentine's or do y'all expect them to do it? Like what, what do y'all do? Because like for me, um, 
I was really like I had to sit down and have like that come to Jesus moment. I sat down and this was like yesterday because um, I was thinking about talking about this yesterday. But I was like, no, nah, nobody cares. But I'm talking about it. OK, so it's part of my vlog. I have always taken my kids and myself out for Valentine's. Usually for Valentine's, I think the only Valentine's I actually got a gift. I was in college. This was the person I was dating, and it was only one time out of the three and a half years that he and I dated. Um, and it was like a bear card, some flowers, kind of, you know, pretty much college appropriate uh, gift. Um, when I got married, I used to get gifts that served him. Like, oh, I like this in the morning so I bought you that or oh I like to do this so I got that you know that type of shit so it wasn't really for me um, or he would be working and he just wouldn't send anything mm -hmm. um, second time around I always got a card you know card lottery ticket um, I would ask for more because I'm, I'm the type I would always get more but I would never get it um, so yeah so I got to a point where I started taking myself out, right? And I always did for my kids, but I started taking myself out. I would get dolled up, I would go take myself out, do whatever, um, and it would be my my time to myself, you know? Um, so that would be my, my I guess, my encouraging words to y'all. Like, if you are one of those, because I have friends who have texted me and they're like, I spent a bad time alone, like I'm almost 40, like when does this end and it's just kind of like, I don't know, I guess I'm just different and <laughs> that type of stuff don't really bother me because I've always been the one I would get up and do for myself. But um, if you are that person, what I would strongly suggest is make sure that you do something for yourself. If you celebrate you, other people will know how to celebrate you. And I know that sounds contradicting because I just told y'all that other people weren't celebrating me. But this is the, the thing behind it. When you celebrate you, other people will celebrate you or they will know how they are supposed to celebrate you. You don't have to wear, you know, uh, wear that on like, oh, they didn't do this for me. They didn't do that for me. You don't have to feel embarrassed. It's, it's nothing on you. Y'all just need to come to an understanding of what you want and what you don't want, what you'll tolerate and what you won't tolerate. Um, if it's a holiday that's not really big to you, then, you know, y'all skip past this. It probably doesn't matter to you, but I'm talking to the ones of y'all who actually get depressed behind this or who get sad or look at other people and say, I wish I had that. It's nothing wrong with wishing you had love, but don't wish what somebody else has because you don't know the story behind their flowers, their cars, their whatever. All you see is what people actually put out. They can be broken. They can have all kind of hell with that woman or man. Um, you know, so you just never really 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 know what's going on but what I would say is if you're looking for things that you can do for yourself let me tell you tell them all let me tell you whatever it is that you enjoy like for me these are things I enjoy to decorate my room like in my house um, and I would set it up you know like how I wanted it to be set um, I did I would always do tulips because that's like one of my favorite flowers I would have my little bottle of champagne I would have my movie picked out for the night that I want to watch you know cuz I'm kind of like a homebody um, I would definitely take myself out to eat I would take my kids out to eat I always got them like some type of basket that I would make um, for them you know and just throw things in there that you know celebrated them or things that they liked along with like a little bear and some candy and stuff like that um gift cards like this is always stuff that i did and i always made sure like i like to shop so i would get something for myself i'd buy something so that it would be here in time like uh one company like i would always get strawberries from a sherry's berries i love their berries they're always fresh they're always really really good they're cold they ship and they come on time and they're delivered on time and last year i got the girls some as well um so that's always like a staple piece that i get for myself so i mean guys just celebrate yourself like to me valentine's day is every day you should treat yourself like this every day because i know i do um you know treat yourself like this every day and then you won't have to worry about what somebody else will or won't do for you now granted it is very good to have those things done for you um but you just gotta know the person if like if you're with somebody and they tell you they don't know how to plan you know ask do they want to you know make the connection see if they want to hook up with one of your not hook up but you know talk to one of your friends or maybe to your kids if you have kids or somebody to get suggestions about things that you like or you know randomly put five things down on a sheet of paper and y'all put it in a thing and give it to them and that helps them kind of plan don't just expect somebody to 
know what it is you want or do what it is like literally I had a relative call me and was just like hey my person that I'm talking to right now saw all this stuff on social media um, so I'm trying to surprise her fly her into Dallas and you know do all this good stuff for her like can you hook me up with somebody that stop August that does this this and that and I'm kind of like God you're gonna you're gonna put yourself in that much pressure just for like one day like you should be doing these things all the time um, but to each his own so y'all let me know down in the comments because I don't want to make this part too um gushy or go into it but you know that's just some stuff like I do so I was just curious about like what y'all do on another note like I'm doing YouTube shorts now do y'all like YouTube shorts or do y'all prefer the videos because uh, I feel like YouTube shorts is kind of just like a little snippet of whatever I'm doing of the day um, still based on like the content that I provide on my channel because I don't want it to be like too off of what I do um, because then it's just like if other people start joining us here on the channel um, I don't want them looking for one thing and we're doing something totally different so um, and for those of y'all that have channels for most of you that have a channel and you produce content I do follow you but if you have a channel you produce content uh, post it down in the comments for me and I'll make sure to follow you guys and I'll share your videos and like and comment and all of that I'm really good with doing those things because you know I believe whatever you put out is what you get back so um, yeah other than that I think I'm about to go eat me some gumbo wash my face for the night because I've already stripped down to like my bra and my robe um, <laughs> and get comfortable and play in the snow with these animals because they have just been especially August this is his first snow so he's been enjoying it Harper here he's he's over it he's done it a few times but this is our first snow here at um, this location that we're in now so yeah all right y'all I love y'all and since it's 8 29 at night I'm gonna go ahead and go and do what moms do check and make sure everybody did what they were supposed to do all that good shit yeah I love y'all. Y'all let me know what y'all doing for yourself for Valentine's and what you're doing for your date for Valentine's. Because like I said, I am dating. So I do <laughs> have to come up with something myself because I don't believe it should be one-sided at all. So um, he really likes the water like way more than I do. And I thought that I was a person that loved water. So I'm going to have to really put some thought behind this to do something special for him. So, all right. Bye, y'all. Okay, y'all. It's Saturday. And it's so late in the day. The snow is finally starting to melt. We have been snowed in for I don't know how many days. Melt in today. See? If you hear a noise, that is August. I just finished filming, so now I gotta put all this stuff back up. Um, Cause I did a haul. And I really think y'all gonna like that video. Like I'm excited to post that video. Yeah, so I'm going to the bank deposit some checks stop August and to Walmart and get some snacks because I haven't cooked and I'm not cooking today and call it a day Woo! hope y'all having a good weekend I want y'all to come do your chores and stuff like that because y'all did not do Saturday chores and I'm tired of the house not being clean all right so we're going to the washer area because my heavy comforters i don't put them in my washing machine mm -mm, no so we take those and put those in the heavy duty and then what else am i doing i'm making valentine's day gift bags for the girls like i always do um i don't know if y'all do y'all v-day shopping early or on time or whatever she's so rude but that's what i'm going to do so bye augie bye heart Augie, did you do that? Did you do this, Augie? Why did I just see this? <laughs>